On it. Grilled cheese double burger. When you get a quiet moment, you take whatever you got. That's right. Coverage you can count on. Local 3 News. We always enjoy getting you excited about the Chattanooga market every Sunday at the First Tennessee Pavilion, but I think this week I might be more excited than ever because Melissa Lale is here uh, with a new vendor to us, Stacy Martin, yep. who has Seahorse Snacks. And I'll let Stacy in a second tell the story behind the name, but that's part of the thrill today, Melissa, is that you see this all the time. The vendors have a backstory. Always, and, and sometimes like, like this particular one, you're just blown away. Um, the miracles, the silver linings, just mm -hmm. really cool stuff. So she does have a terrific story. Okay, but I do wanna say this before we bring her in, um, that for a lot of these vendors, coming to you at the market is kind of their first step in making this craft they've been working on public to people. Yeah. It's, it's a lot of courage for them. Isn't it? it is, it is. And we try and be a, a, almost a test kitchen, right? So that it's a low entry as far as cost wise to introduce your product to a lot of people, mm -hmm. um, see what flies, see what you need to tweak. And in a lot of cases, we call them our babies grown up, you know, and you and I have talked about different examples of, of people who now have stores around town on their own. Right. Not everybody wants to do that. Um, I definitely see Stacy as being one of those people. Okay, so Stacy was setting out her wares and she has these beautiful packaged bags of nuts, right? Almonds and cashews, is that right, Stacy? Yeah. Yes. And um, I noticed right away the names because obviously there was a health benefit to these, it appeared. I had no idea what the story was gonna be, so I'm gonna shush and let you tell. Thank you. So Seahorse Snacks is the name of my company and the way that it got its name is that seahorses don't have stomachs and neither do I. So three years ago I found out that I had a really rare genetic mutation that gave me an 80% chance of getting stomach cancer in my lifetime. And the cancer's diffuse so it grows in the lining of your stomach and it's really hard to find. So I could either do surveillance uh, every six months or I could have my stomach removed. So in September of 2019, I had my stomach removed and then they found 17 spots of cancer that we didn't know were there. So had you not done that, you would not be here today? Not at all. <laughs> so what you do now, and we won't get too personal with it, but you have to be careful in the amounts of food you consume. So the nuts really became a lifeline for you. Is that right? Absolutely. I made these snacks for me. So I have to eat every two hours um, and I need to eat a lot of protein because that's what fuels me. So these nuts were a great solution that I could just throw in my bag, eat on the go. Um, and it was my way of sharing my love of food and my story with the world. Okay. So I'm looking at the flavors that you have. You only, is it just two different seasonings that you provide? Yes. I have two flavors. Uh, the first one is sweet. It's, uh, it's called Maple Chai Tastic, and it's my better for you version of a candy pecan. And the second one is Savory. Uh, it's called Chili Turmeric, and it's a blend of uh, chili and garlic and turmeric, and it's more flavorful than spicy. So, is this your first year at the market? Uh, I started in the middle of last year, but this is my first full year at the market. Do yes. you have fun? watching people open up a bag after they purchase them and then dig in and then dig in again and then again? Well, it starts with the sampling. So that's really my uh, secret weapon uh, <laughs> to get these snacks into the hands of everybody. Um, nobody can resist a sample and they're really pleasantly surprised uh, when they try them and that's when they turn into customers. You know, I bet that your mind, Melissa, is already going where mine is because sadly I'm thinking about the holidays. I think a lot of us <laughs> are. We do, yeah. This is a great one to snag up and even just, I mean, buy enough to enjoy now, but keep and put aside. Right. Because what a crowd pleaser. Exactly. I'm thinking stocking stuffer because mm -hmm. you and I are always thinking that in July. <laughs> Sick and people. We, we are. We are. And um, also, yeah, putting it out for parties, just always having a couple mm -hmm. bags on hand. And I love the turmeric aspect. I myself am a huge turmeric believer mm -hmm. and take it, but I'd rather eat my turmeric than, yeah, than, than you know, put, it in put a pill. Milk. Yeah. So I think it's such, I mean, did you expect it to take off like it has, Stacy? I had no idea. I just, it seemed like a good idea and we're going with it. So uh, I've had a lot of great support by uh, Chattanooga. So it's been a really exciting adventure so far. And I know that you're, you're living here now. You have been in the Atlanta area for a while, but happily for us, Chattanooga is home. Yeah. Um, so at the market this week, is there a theme? Uh, bluegrass. 
So oh, that's a fun one. Yeah, it's really perfect. It's you know, it's just going to be hot and <laughs> probably rain. And what a better way to spend the afternoon? You're undercover. Right. We've got the big fans. Grab an icy cold lemonade. Listen to some music and get some snacks. Well, I think it is really fun. And you know, when you are there, obviously you want to not pry in too much to people's lives, but don't be embarrassed as a shopper to get to know the vendors. They yeah. all have some kind of a story. They do, and that's what they're there for, is to share it, so yeah. yeah. Well, congratulations. Thank you, Stacy, for coming, and here's where you can find her. By the way, do you have a website of your own? I do, it's seahorsesnacks.com. Easy to remember. Better thing is to go to the market this Sunday. You can get to know her personally. That website is chattanoogamarket.com, 11 to four at the pavilion. Uh, and we might see you munching on some nuts together. It's great to see you. You too. Camo or flannel?